real simple. And and I remember, and I came back in, like it was just real easy. Like it wasn't like, like you know, listen, I ain't never been a smart person, but you know, like I said, I was able to do things based upon the guidance of Yahweh Shemi And um. And I remember Pastor Hard said, he asked me, like, he just remembered me. He said, where you been? I just looked. I said, I moved upstate. And he said, okay. <laughs> it was like real, like, just like that. I was like, oh, man. Like, you know? Like, he just, like, it was just the spirit, like, the spirit when he asked me, he said, where you been at? And then again, because he asked me again, well, but I was, you know, with the Philly brothers. So he hadn't been seeing me. So... When he saw me again, where you been at? And I stopped, and Elder stuck around. He was like, um, he been in Philly. He said, okay. <laughs> but um, it was in the spirit, man. And like I said, the Lord has preserved me because, you know, hey, when you're learning this, man, there's a lot to it, but it's simple. It's not no, like, you know, once you get the understanding, then he's up. That's being preserved. Getting the understanding. We just read that. Let's go see if we can find that verse. Dang, I just seen that verse. All right. And that's how you get preserved in this thing. And the Lord will guide you from there. Just seen that. Oh, is this it? I keep right now, but I'm just finding um another verse. Jeez. But I wanted to find that one I just read. Was it was the spirit? I think it was chapter uh I don't forgot what chapter it was. I think it was Baruch 4 or, um, I think it was 4. Yeah, it was 4. Because we're getting the understanding now of our, of our heritage, man. This was going to make us illuminate. You know? I know it's here, man. I just was running through verses, like, real quick. So, like, I didn't, I didn't mean I um, lose my, um, because that one stuck out. I just want to read it again. And I can't believe it that because I could have been the one just destroyed individual, bro. You know? I think about it right now. The Lord preserved me to get his understanding. Man, what universe was that? Jesus, I just read it. <laughs> I thought it was Baruch chapter um chapter four. But I read it. Um it was just something about understand wisdom and understanding and knowledge. And that's just that's how you get preserved in these scriptures, man. That's the first step, man. Oh, it must have been three. Jeez, man. Come on, Lordski. And we are being preserved. All right, I can't. I forgot where it was at, brother Salaki. Um, I know it was just, just. It came out. It was dynamic because it came. It was a spirit. But I know. Um. Yeah, here we go. Salaki is Baruch chapter three, verse fourteen. Learn where is wisdom, where is the strength. Where is understanding that thou mayest know also where is the length of days and life? Okay, where is the light of the eye and peace, man? So that's that's what we got right there. This understanding is truth. There's wisdom, is truth, and we being and we and that's what that's why we're being preserved in these days, man. These last days, man. The last days of the last days. We being um preserved and we not being put to death, man. Cause you know, I was just watching Pastor Hall, he said people that not individuals that came up with the truth back then with him, but now they put to death. They're not around no more. So we that's why we still got our hands on the plow. Right? Who verse 15, who has found out her place in these scriptures? Oh, who has come into her treasures? The treasures, the fear of the Lord is thy treasure. Mm, mm, mm. 
to lock you. Just that's just stuck out. And the Lord is in. Let's go back to Psalm chapter fifty, verse fifteen. And call upon me in a day of trouble. I will deliver thee, and thou shalt glorify me. We're gonna glorify the Lord Yah Yah Shah. That's what we're doing right now. Do I Yah Bashim El Shah? Uh, you know, I say that all the time. Do I Yah Bashim El Shah for preserving me? Jeez. Hey, thank you. So you know, that was just um. Let's go back to this one because I don't think I read this one. This 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 is where I got all these verses from. It came from off of this. I was reading this one, and I, it just the spirit of Yahweh Shemel um brought the rest out. I'm just a vessel seeking salvation. I'm seeking salvation, man. I'm doing this for salvation. I want to make it out of here, man, because I I'm terrified of this place, man. I don't want the Lord to leave us, leave me here. You know, that's what it's about. I don't want to get left here. I don't, you know, do the spirit. You know, I'm always meditating on these words in this book. And I and I go into it. I tell you, man, these words comfort me, man. It's, they really do. And being taught by the men, and every time I watch videos, it's like certain things just pop in my head, like precepts. You know, certain words, certain key words leads to verses. Psalm to the twenty-seven, verse five. For in the time of trouble, he shall hide us in his pavilion. In the secret of his tabernacle shall he hide us. He it's gonna be a us because it's gonna be a it's gonna be a remnant. It's not gonna just be me, it's a, it's gonna be a us. I wrote that song one I'm calling I am have a confidence that that the spirit of Shimel Shah, if he got these words running through my head, you know, he don't got me doing the old shit I used to do. He he, he I'm in his thoughts. Because it has to be angels camping around you giving me these thoughts. You know, you might got motherfuckers, <laughs> so like, not my, a certain demon jumping around, you try to get at you, fucking make you stumble in your words. No. But that you, that's not in your heart. Yahweh Shem Yashah know your heart. For in the time of trouble, he shall hide us in the pavilion, in his pavilion, in the, in the secret, in the secret of his tabernacle. Shall he hide us? Shall he, shall he hi, hide us? Yeah. He shall set us up upon a rock. So that's what he's doing right now. And upon that rock is Yahweh Shah. You know? I brought this out one of these men, man. This is dynamic, man. This is really, really dynamic. You know, the spirit of Yahweh Shemel Shah jumps on me to um bring these verses out, you know, and go into these scriptures. And I'll just be sitting here reading it. And, I, and it starts in this book. You know, this book got all the secrets, man. I'd like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yah Bashem El Shah, Bashem Kakodash, Dwadi Yah Bashem El Shah, for the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone, Shalom to the Akim, Wa Abba Abba, Kum Yah Shalom.